I've mentioned I have like a bajillion tactics games and we need to start getting through them. And I don't know which one to, to play first because they, they, look, they all look really good actually. But there's just so many of them and they're usually really long at tactics games because you have to teach how all of the things interact with each other and it's a very slow, it's, you know, it's RPG style. So I attack, you attack, I attack, you attack moving around a map it's slow to reach the enemies and things like that but we're going to try and play a couple of them today because i need to start getting through them before they pile up to be too crazy and the first one i'm going to play is vanaris tactics vanaris tactics i've had this demo for a very long time and it's not like i've been trying to avoid it it's just sometimes when i see a demo and i'm like oof, that's going to be you know an hour and a half to two hours long i try to stay away maybe it won't be but we'll see uh, Fenaris Tactics. And the art style is cool as hell. But yeah, I actually really like Tactics Battle Games. It's just, they can be very slow, especially the intro. And because they're, you know, they can be like JRPG style stories as well, there's a lot to go through. Warrior, you have nowhere to run now. Surrender. Final Fantasy Tactics, some of the best games ever. So good. That's, this is not gonna happen. Not again. Morgana. Only Laozin can save one's life. If we can't get you to understand that, I'll let him tell you in person. What? This is another thing. Like, they have to introduce this crazy story and shit, so... Turn this down a little bit. Brother! Another of your kind. I'll ask nicely for the last time. Surrender, otherwise the consequences will be severe. We're willing to face them. This time, we fight back. Oh shit, 2v1. Get wrecked, warrior. You don't even have a sword or anything. Morgana, remember to, whenever possible, attack the enemy from their sides or back. It'll increase your chances of hitting them, yes. And uh, you get to keep your distance if you want to hit him with your crossbow. Well, that sounds like a really good thing to do right now. Like, I can attack him with my crossbow from the back. And then, maybe I'm going to try and get the high ground. She can jump up there! Awesome. Um, that's wait there, I guess. Uh, can I not, like, base this direction, though? That would have been nice, but I guess not. Oh, yeah, I can. Cool. That's what that was. That's his turn. Ooh, he's moving next to me. But this guy's a brawler, right? Oh, he does have a sword. I'm just going to beat your face up, okay? I'm going to break your goddamn face right now. What, what is my attack? I guess it's, yeah. But I can attack a... If I move here, though, can I attack you? No, because it's two steps up. So let me undo that. And I really like that you're allowed to undo. Um, that makes this a lot nicer to play. You know what? Maybe I just run away. And face him. I can't attack. So then I wait, like, facing this way. And we try and use Morgana for the high ground. So attack. She moves here. Can she attack? She can. Nice. Six in the back. Wait, facing this way. Can you reach me? One, two, three. You can reach me. Okay. I was making sure that she could shoot, but... Final Fantasy Tactics are awesome. Yeah, man, they really are. Super special games. And I liked, you know, the, I saw triangle strategy and stuff, and the game looked cool, but it also looked like it was a lot more going on and the maps were way bigger and the thing i liked about final fantasy tactics is the maps were kind of small so you were it wasn't just moving 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 and then you start fighting it was it was a little it was a little like uh more condensed but triangle strategy i don't know i saw it was a bit bigger and it kind of put me off i haven't played it so i can't say what it's actually like but oh i have a sword as well okay well i'm gonna have to wait facing him you got the collector's edition, sweet. Yeah, I hope it's good, man. If it, if it is good, I'll definitely end up playing it. It's like, it's when you're controlling too many combatants, then it feels more like this big war game. And I liked, you know, you have a party of four people or whatever, and you're moving around this kind of arena that's really interesting because it's dynamic. Like, there's rivers that you have to cross, and there's mountains to climb, and there's the high ground to consider, and getting knocked off, you know, into a wall and things like that. But it's kind of in a smaller area. Otherwise, it can get a little bit too long and the fights and too, can, you know, 
grandiose, but... Yeah, I definitely haven't done it. Why does she get another turn? Okay, her, she must have a good speed. This guy's dead. He's not dead! I'm gonna wait. Warrior, surrender. Surrender! You got one life left. You done goofed, son. Oh, mistake. It's execution time. Bow your head. Swing! Yo, we just got absorbed <laughs> by the angels. I actually got a board game that was supposed to be like Final Fantasy Tactics. It was a tiny epics game and it was kind of trash. It was pretty much the worst tiny epics game I've ever, ever played. And I backed it on Kickstarter. I was so excited and I played one game of it and I was like, Ugh. we tried it a couple more times. It's like, son. Most of my troops shifted to the village's northern gate. Boris and Nigel. Are these named after UK politicians? Where is your brother? Where's Adrian? He's almost my age, Dad. I took him outside disguised as a soldier. He'll be waiting for you to under the bridge to Araguaya. With some supplies I could spare. And how about Zara? Have you heard about her? I'm sorry, Aunt. I don't know about her. Aunt, so we're brother and sister. Yeah, he did say she did say she did say brother. And from Araguaya, where do we go? I don't really know the situation out there. I'm sorry, your best bet is Umbra, dude. C calm down, all right. I don't. The more things you throw at me, the more names, the less inclined I am to remember any of them. If you give me one name and a place, cool. Two names, two places, maybe. Start throwing out names and places. I don't know who's who. I don't know what's what. And I'm going to forget everything because I just care less. You know, like, stop. Calm down with the geography of the world, all right? Best bet is on Umbra going through Casim Casimira on the way to Araguaya. <laughs> Come on, bro. Many of the rebels are fleeing from there. That's why, from what I heard. I couldn't ask for much information because my superiors know I have relatives in Ramona. You see what I'm saying? Now I don't know anything. I've lost it all. There's a huge sacrifice um, of yours already, kid. We appreciate it. So we're like rebels or something. This government is coming in. We're rebels. And our and this guy's son is in the army, but kind of as an insider. I guess it's time for us to go, sis. You both got great hair, by the way. You got this awesome hair. You got a cool beard. You don't. You just look... You're normal. Here, take this. Wait, this is Briss I gave you when you... When they took you from us. Ah, they took him and trained him. I'm glad you kept it for so long. I was always wearing it. Never took it off. It'll bring you good luck. Bye, son. Goodbye, Nige. My boy. I know how you feel. Dot, 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 dot. What? What? Excuse me? Take care, you three. What do you mean, you three? Is the dog going with him? What? What? <laughs> okay. Random street dog. Yes. So cute. The best part about Final Fantasy Tactics were the judges. That would be in the map. And if you and and every fight would have like rules like on this fight you're not allowed to use lightning magic. Or on this fight, you're not allowed to stun an enemy. Which made it really hard because sometimes it was like, I have to stun an enemy. And then if you did stun them, the judge would give you a ticket and you'd like go to jail and you'd have to pay the ticket. But you could also hit the judge, and that would he would mess you up. It'd be like hitting the uh like hitting the referee in um Celebrity showdown, you just like you don't fuck with the judge. I've seen them, they're coming for us. Oh, how did come they how did they find us? They must be following us since uh, we crossed the river. I know them well. If they're willing to attack us, we're probably being outnumbered. Also had a really dark story. And you like started off by learning how to play the game by having a snowball fight. 
but then you got like isekai'd to another world. And then you were in like a war and stuff, but you were kids, but you grew up in this other world. And I don't think it even took you back to the real world at the end. You were just like, this is your life now. You went to another world, your parents think you're dead. And uh, yeah, now you're in the middle of a war and you're like a soldier, okay? Morgana, Adri, and the en uh, enemies coming from all the south sides were surrounded. <laughs> Stay close to each other, okay. <sighs> They've got like little foxes. Afonso, not Alfonso, just Afonso. So this is where you've been hiding her. I knew you wouldn't go too far. It's time to sell this. Show us what you've taken. We don't have that much to share. Oh, these are just like bandits. Don't lie. Don't you think I know one of those soldiers is Nigel's son? You convinced us to start this rebellion and now you're fleeing. Things aren't any easier for us. You still refuse to acknowledge how grievous this is, huh? Let's teach you a lesson then. Oh, you guys are about to get decked. I'm going to beat you up. Defeat all enemies. Okay, what, what have you got, son? What, what weapon are you? Alfonso is the most dangerous of them. He's got an S-stop. That weapon causes a stars effect. Tidens bird. Hello. Oh, he's, he's, a, he's a domster cool fan. He's got an S stock. It's a, oh, he's got bleed. He'll probably focus on one of us to make them bleed. When someone's bleeding, they use it. Okay, it's like poison. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's just bleeding over time, yeah. It'll take him two or three hits. If uh, one hit away, you want to get away from him. Okay, all right. So we want to gang up on him quickly, maybe. The same goes for the Chris you got there. It causes poison. Takes portion, okay, based on their max HP. So it's a percentage, so poison's way better. It's a percentage over just straight damage. Uh, it makes sense to poison the enemy with high max health. Yep, yep. So let's get this guy with the poison, like immediately. Uh, you, skill, smog, plus poison. Hmm. Let's, let's move first. We're gonna move here. And I'm gonna, oh no, no, I want, I want to poison you with this smog. Oh, okay, I couldn't. I can't move that. I've got to move here. Skill. Smog on this guy. I gotta poison him. Nice. Okay. He has been a poisoned. So then we're gonna have to wait. We'll face this way. It is. Oh, that is a lot of light. That is a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. And then she can get away from this guy so that he doesn't she doesn't get bled. Yeah, bled bleed starts like starts piling up. I see. You skill, you have a throw. Oh, Alright, okay. And your attack is in this range. Can I I can move oh, I can move all this way. This guy's really fast. And then I can attack you with this to get another poison, maybe stack. He's poisoned, yeah, yeah. We've, we've filled his poison bar back up anyway. That's what that did. Now there's these little foxes. They can jump down. I downloaded the Simulacra 3 demo. How did you like it? I didn't get to finish it because um, I, I played it for like an hour and 20 minutes, but then I kind of got stuck and I didn't want to. It was a really late night, but that game was awesome. I need, I, I actually bought like uh, the, the the pack of the other two because they were, it's a trilogy. Um, so I bought Simulacra 1 and 2 to play through first, which is, uh, I'm excited to get to. Right, you, ha these guys have got to be weak, right? These dogs. I'm thinking the best thing we can do here is probably move and start fighting these two down here. and We can deal with everything else afterwards. Skill, whirlwind strike. This is gonna, is, does this do more damage than normal? I, you know what? It's a skill. It has to, right? Whirlwind strike? Uh, why can't I use it? I guess, I, I don't know. Effect HP minus 18. That's not great. Skill. Oh, and it hits everybody around me. Okay, okay, that's all it is. Okay, well, I'll just attack you for now. 18's pretty nice. It's okay. It's okay. I'm gonna face this way, yeah. You're not gonna be able to get to us. Hopefully, you don't have a ranged attack. I fear that she might. No. Okay, we're good, we're good. Me again. Okay, attack. I want you to go down. So I want to skill smog you again. You know what? I actually don't do. I want to move behind you. And get a... Uh... It's a ranged. She's ranged, isn't she? So she actually can't do that. What she should do is probably move back here. And attack like this. 
16. You know what? Yeah, we need to focus on this guy because we don't want the bleed. We're going to wait. It's you. Ooh, baby. You're going down. We don't want him to get bleed up. You completed it. Oh, nice. Yeah, it was it was challenging, but it was really cool. And it had like a nice spooky element to it. I really liked. Right, okay. What we're going to have to do now is I think we're going to move here. We're going to finish this guy off. He only has, he has 20 life left. Only minus six. That's not good. Skill, throw shrug. Minus nine. This guy kind of is garbage, right? Undo. But he can use an item. Uh, attack. Yeah, he's, he's not very strong. What if I move here? Oops. What if I move here? And attack this guy. Yeah, minus six. It's just not good enough. But if I move here, I want to see how much life these guys have. Oh crap, they have a lot of life. We're not we're not gonna do too well here. Undo. Skill throw shuriken. Nine. Well that's because it's head-on, maybe. Nine. What if I move like here and throw shuriken in this guy's back instead? Does that do anything? Does that nine still. Nine's not good enough. We're gonna throw it in this guy's back. Um, because this guy needs 10 damage. On the flower part, select Iris, Elm, Beads, Columbine, Purple. Ah, because, it, yeah, and I was looking for the answer because it was... I know she kept sending code, coded messages, but it was, I, I, I don't think I could decipher it. I sent a couple of flowers. I love tactics games, man. They're just... The problem is fights like this, they can be really long. So you can do, like, a couple of fights a, a day, basically. Like, you play... You play at night in bed, like you do a couple of fights and you Game Boy Advance and that's kind of it. That's all you can fit in. Yeah, fight him head on. That's good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then move. Okay. The Coyotes are coming, but we need this guy dead and this guy dead ASAP. So you, this guy... Let's see what we can do here. I need this guy to take 10 damage because he's going to take another 10 damage on his on his turn and die. If I move here, can I attack him? 16. You know, that'll do. Let's just kill him. I think it's... Yeah. We want, we want him dead, so why not? Maybe I can bandage her next turn. I'm going to move here behind you. We can tank a bit. I think this guy can tank a bit. And we can attack you. If you actually surround us... Oh! He's so close to dying. 1 HP. Damn. She's, she's moving up. She's moving up. Oh, she does have a ranged attack. I knew it. Okay. I want this guy to be in the middle to get Whirlwind Strike. You should die. Excellent. You're dead. Um, my turn. How much life? I wish I... Can I not click? Ah, oh, there we go. 34, 46. You know what? We're okay for life right now. Let's... Let's... Skill? Can I... Sh I don't have any SP. Can I move here? You are kind of weak. So I can use your attack to just finish this guy off. Just to get him out of the... The turn order. So he doesn't get an, a lot, one last turn. Simulacra Pipe Dreams. Oh, nice. I'll have to check that out. 16 on the Coyote. That's that's good. Pretty nice damage. Almost half. You know what? Um, I'm going to move just one step back here so that I'm, I can kind of face my attacker. Yes. Yes, you move here. You move here. And I'll whirlwind strike both of you. That would be awesome. That would be excellent. Come on. Coyote, I know you want to. Come on. Come on. Damn it. Damn it. Close. Okay. Um, I guess I can just attack you. Minus 18 is pretty nice. I wouldn't mind attacking you as well, though. I can move here and whirlwind strike both of you. I would like to try it out, so. Go on, dude. 
Whirlwind Strike. Yeah! <laughs> nice. It was awesome. It was just as cool as I hoped. You're a ranged attacker, so I'm going to face the Coyote instead. Ah. And I kill you. She has nine life. I can kill her. I'm going to just, like, look her dead in the eyes as I shoot an arrow into her face. Me and you. Get out of here. And now there's just your pets to take care of. Move. 18. Full life. We'll move behind you. Get you with a quick little attack. This guy's kind of weak, so he's probably just going to... He's got a little dagger, yeah. Oh, but he builds poison. That's the thing, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm forgetting that. That's that's really big. Attacking me head on? Bro. Now you move into the perfect whirlwind position. You're a genius. Do I do I have enough SP for another whirlwind strike? I hope so. I don't think I will actually. I bet it's 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 way too strong. Ah oh, no, he's running away! Coward! Move here. Oh my guy moved out of the way. That's nice. Attack. I can't kill you. I can kill you, though. Goodbye. Wait. Oh, beard man. Skill. Yeah, it costs three, and I have six SP. That's pretty awesome. This guy's the best. Excuse me. I've just got to kill a, a dog. A wild dog. I've got to put down this coyote. Okay. Dun-dun. Dun-dun. Dun dun. Level up! Level up! Nice, this is cute. Okay. Why don't you skip me head in the game a little bit and let me get a taste of, of, a, of a fight that's gonna, you know, later on. So we can see how the characters grow. That's what I want to see. No, please. Let me go. Dude, you're already dead. I poisoned the shit out of you. You're gone. You outie. Will you please keep your dignity while we decide if you live or not? Yeah. Shut up, kid. Keep watching our surroundings. Oh, dude. What the hell? I was desperate. I want my freedom back. I know you're feeling like it's too. They took everything I had. Did you? How did you leave Ramona? Ramona. My, my, my. We saw you leaving and followed you. Great. <laughs> and where did you get these weapons? Well, they uh, they gave us these so soldiers. They wanted us to slow you down, <gasps> as they suspected you're the ones stolen supplies. God damn it! So now the soldiers are coming, you assholes! And you accuse me of betraying the others? How ironic! I'm gonna kill you! Whoa! <laughs> Drankis, Drankis, um. Is he any worse than us? I mean, we were desperate as well. And at the first opportunity we had, we left without looking back. Please, listen to the man. Are you sure of that? We'd be killing another of our kind. We'd be contributing to the extinction of our own culture. Our own people. You're very considerate, mister. I know who your son got his kindness from. What did you say about my son? Get out of here. You brat. So we're off to Casimira. I'm hopeful about all this. I feel bad for spending so many years in this place and leaving without a coin. Freedom. It's priceless. That's what matters. You're right. About Zara. Do you think Boris knew something? I can't, get, can't call people Boris anymore. About her. When I asked him about my daughter, he seemed uncomfortable. He was always a good boy. I, uh, I wonder if he didn't want to tell me something. Don't worry. I know she's fine. I can feel it. She must be pretty badass, just like you. Why did it take us so long to do anything? To be forced to work and not be able to see our kids anymore. Why were we okay with that for all these years? What were we thinking? Because it involved our kids. We had two options, to stay and work, to provide for them, or to flee and leave them behind. True. What I don't get is, why did they take Boris and Zara to the capital and not me? Their religion. It didn't demonizes all the religions from the south. They believe that once you turn 10, you can't be converted anymore. Ah, they think we're all filthy creatures. If you recall that, you were already 10 when that happened. Your brother, 
nine. Then there's the belief that the reason the South is miserable, our lack of faith in Lautzen, their god. We're gonna kill Lautzen. You were too young to remember we used to live in an oligarchy. Uh, as we natives were colonized. Oh my god. Too real. Come on. Venaris. Oh, Venaris. Finally, we heard about Venaris. That's what this game's called. Venaris Tactics. Founded by immigrants. Uh, Southern Republic. I, I, politics, honestly. I can't deal. All that point, they started calling us the Generation Zero. They split us from our kids. Blah, 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 blah. By those on Iris. What's Iris? I... I'm done talking about this. Let's move. Oh, thank God. Someone. Someone's saying. Let's do this. Geopolitical, like, stories in video games. Oh, Jesus Christ. I could I could do without. So, as mentioned, North Asseries is, at, is west. I marked it with blue on the map. It's supposed to be peaceful. Let's go there. We can buy stuff in the shop. Blah, 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 blah. But the red town... Oh, no, we have to go here anyway. Our current objective is to get to South Connors. So Let's go to blue. Uh, shop. You can introduce me. I, I, I say that, but you can introduce me to, like, the geopolitical, you know, uh, tides of, of your world if you're world building. But it can't be the first thing you talk about. You know what I mean? You have to you have to get me in there first. You have to get me into the game. Before you start going crazy with the backstory. Bye. Um we have one of all of those. We have a we can get a buckler. That'd be pretty nice. Let's get a buckler. Um for the, the main guy. In fact, we should probably get a buckler. Oh, only he can use it. Okay. Anti-flame jacket. Increases jump by two. Okay. Items. Uh, nah. But we could get fire resistance. I mean, we don't even have the money for it, so I guess not. Can we sell stuff? Nah. Quit. Really wasn't that much to buy there. We couldn't even get uh, an upgraded weapon or anything. What about party data? Can we do anything with the, like, the level up? Uh, who wants mountain boots? Probably you. I, you're already. You have a lot of movement, so mountain boots is gonna help you get to people and start putting poison on them really fast, which is nice. Nigel, you want the buckler? Uh, no, you want the the buckler here. That's nice. Morgana, you got nothing. You you get absolutely nothing. You're not allowed anything. So, um, data. Oh, it's just safe. Okay, yeah. Of course it is. Well, that was pretty simple. Let's move. Enter. Fight, 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 fight. Come on, one more fight. We can call it quits. This looks like a fight to me. These look like some thieves, rogues. Um, may I know what's going on here? God damn it, Lila. See what you've done? I'm gonna freaking kill you. See, that's your problem. You can't talk your way through any situation. If things don't go your way, you fix it by attacking whoever disagrees with you. Don't try to fool me. You are going to leave with the uh, the thing. The thing, the thing. I'm sure we can sort it out. I'm sure we can sort it out in a non-violent way. Yeah, we'll see about that. This definitely looks like a fighting situation. Don't get any closer outside or you're not getting anything from us. Uh, not going to lie. Now you got me curious. What's so special uh, that you two can't let anyone know about? See, if you didn't throw a tantrum and bite, it would be cool now. Still, I think we can settle this... Pacifically. <laughs> like, pacifist... Pacifically? Right after dealing with the outsider. Oh. In a violent way. What? Okay. Well, that just started from absolutely nothing, but sure. Do I get to place my, my party down? Is that what... I'm, yep, yep, yep. Um, I'm going to put... 34. What are you? 39. You... Leela is the... Yeah, she can go there, whatever. Uh, I, how do I move up here? I want to see this guy's life. I can't do it. Okay. I want this guy to start applying poison to, like, this Leela or whatever. So I want her. I want him to be able to jump up there and start attacking. The other guy... I should have given him the boots. You know what? This guy here... 
Didn't I just start them all here? Who cares? You can start... Uh, you're on like a low ground area. You know what? Just start them. Let's see. Yeah, yeah. Whatever. This is probably going to be the last fight. Unless it does something and moves us forward in the game. Because we know how this plays, you know what I mean? This is what I'm saying a lot with demos. You've got to... Oh, we can scroll through the stuff. You've got to, like, move on in the demo as well. I want to be able to... To see how the game progresses. What are you... What is your life like? 46, 40. Okay, I would very much like to poison you. Like, immediately. Love it. Love it. You're poisoned now. <laughs> Done. Let's see. Seven? Eh? It's good. Oh, he's going to throw a dagger at me or something. Explosion! God damn! Okay. Calm down. And now he's hiding. So he's, he's a mage. You? Oh, it's your turn. Oh my god, you're all going before me. Jesus. Skill haste. God damn, she's going to put herself back in the turn order twice. And you're backing off as well, you... Pussies. Get back here. Right. Can you reach anybody? You cannot. Hopefully you don't have a, a ranged attack. You're, you're miles away. If you have a ranged attack, I'm in trouble. Because you're going to be shooting me in the back. I wish you could tell if an enemy was ranged or not by the look of them. You know what I mean? That would be pretty useful. Um, I'm going to go here. Because my goal is to start putting poison on the guys with most life. And kind of chase them down. You are going to be the person who deals with these big guys. 20 damage? That level up. Nice. I feel it. Yeah, you're just going to smash these kids. Me and you move. Actually, can I smog you as well? I could probably smog her. But you know what? 40 damage. Poison does how much damage then? Because seven's quite a lot. It does like 20%. Um, which is quite a lot. 20% will be 8 damage. Not 8, but... Nah, I'd probably do like 6 damage to her, right? 5 damage. Which isn't so bad, but after a couple of turns, it, it adds up. But maybe we should focus on doing 16. It's pretty nice. This guy would die, actually, at 16, so why don't we kill him? And then he just falls out of turn order. The less... It's all about, just like a lot of any strategy game like this, is all about action points. How many actions do you have? Which is why haste is so important, because it gives you more actions per turn. If, if there are 10 enemies and two of me, they're going to have 10 turns in my two turns. And even if I'm attacking and killing, you know, two at a time, 10 of them are attacking me. So this is, uh, yeah, all about action economy. Oh, man, I wish this guy could go there. Maybe he can. One, two, three, four. I don't think he can. One, two, three. One, two, three, I think he did. Right, you... you this guy, bald beard. You, nah, you, you're not getting anywhere. You're done. By the time you get into the fight, it's game over, all right? She needs to heal. My, my ranger needs to heal. Um, attack. I want to put... Uh, I might as well put more poison on you. This guy's 50 poison. I want to keep the poison going. So let me actually... Let me do that instead. Make sure the poison stays up. Kind of wait there. Make some room to move bearded man. Sleep. Oh, damn. These mages, dude. She's getting away. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five. There's no way he can move anywhere near. Yeah. 
He can get in front of this guy's face. Which is what I'm going to do. I'm just going to attack him clean in the nose. Uh, attack. 20. Still going to do 20. Ah, but the hit percent is lower. Okay, so... He's dead. <laughs> that guy's gone. So I didn't need to apply poison to him, actually. That's the shame. So we're going to face you. You are low on life, to be honest. But I still think it's worth... Skill. I'm gonna try and smog you then as well. Why not? You wanna you wanna see what sleep like? What about forever? You know what I'm saying? The long sleep, baby. You're down and asleep, apparently. Oh no, that's me. That's me. Dude, I already told you by the time you get to the fight, it's Jeej. Okay? You just you just go home. Six, okay, yeah. By 15%. Trying to like back up right into the corner. I mean, it's it's nice. This guy's gonna fall out of turn order, I guess, right? Because he doesn't yet. Yeah. Oh. Oh no, wait. Wrong, wrong person. I'm just going to shoot you in the face. Ping! And one, two, three. I can move with this guy. Is it his turn? Sleeping guy's turn. Yeah, he's gonna fall out of turn order, but he should wake up. He didn't wake up, goddamn. Well, good night. Dink. This is hilarious. Uh, are you gonna hit my sleeping dude? You are. Dude, your bosses are dead. And so is your friend. Just leave. I'll let you go. He woke me up, though, which is nice of him. Let's consider it. Attack. We're actually going to attack and then move with her because we don't want to get, uh... We don't want to get killed. Oh, baby. Get poisoned. Yeah! I'm just going to wait right here. Oh, God. It's time. It's time to face the music. 92%. Come on, baby. Dead. Right. Sweet. Fairly simple. Fairly simple fights. We just went straight after the problem. Instead of backing up and taking out the, the minions first, we went straight after the problem, take down the people, start playing some poison to the people with uh, a lot of health, and they, had a, they were doing a lot of damage, so take them out first, and then, you know, we can deal with the riffraff afterwards. It was good. We had enough we had enough health and we do enough damage that we can just kind of tank that. Yo! I got a sweet helmet. Like Devil Knight. Is he the captain? Whoa, dragon! Dragon Lord. Boris, what's going on here? You tell us. What the hell is going on here? Paladin. Uh, treason! Treason is the word for what's going on here. You failed, Venaris. And you know how we punish traitors, right? No, Boris! That's ridiculous. I don't know what you're talking about. Hmm, don't waste my time. Come in! Who? Oh, mother! We let you live, bro! We let you live! You, oh my god, the things I'm going to do to you. You're going to get hung, drawn, and quartered when I get hold of you. I'm going to pull your nose off. Oh, you don't even have a nose. I'm going to make you a new nose. I'm going to stab you right there. It was him, I can assure you. What? Are you going to blindly trust the words of a rebel? Can you back up this claim? This, his father was wearing his bracelet, fell from his wrist when he stopped the woman from attacking me. Leave. Shit. That's a huge misunderstanding. Don't look at me like this. I know it's yours. Soldiers, you know what to do. No, Boris! Mother. I can't believe he just... He, we let him away and then he did that. You blast. I liked it. Venaris Tactics. Um, I mean, the tactics part of it didn't really do anything special or unique. It was just a classic strategy, a uh, classic tactics game. 
uh, which is fine. I'm going to give it a three. The story itself, very, you know, political, and that was kind of, you know, putting me to sleep. But then that happened at the end. Woo! I'm back in, baby. Now I've got a reason. I've got a reason to fight. I want to come back and I want to absolutely uh, smash up these people. That's cool. Yeah, they really hooked me at the end there. That's very clever. That's very clever. I like that a lot. But the strategy of the actual game itself, I think, very classic tactics game. It didn't have anything like on top of that. You know, there wasn't any other meter management or special abilities that were like out of the ordinary. You know, it was sleep, poison, bleed, jumping up to higher locations, getting the high ground didn't even seem to matter. Uh, yeah, not, not too much extra going on, but it was nice. It worked. It was, it was good. It looked nice. And then they really hooked me there at the end. Got me.